on the GCN Radio Network. And now, live from Austin, Texas, Alex Jones. The video is now up on InfoWars.com. The incredible incrimination. Alex Jones joins Homeland Security. That's right, folks. I've made the decision to buy into the paranoia. I love Obama. 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 All right, finish up, Dave. So, so you, what ended up happening when you blew the whistle on the corruption? Well, it, it all turned out well for me. Um, uh, the, uh, the county board of directors uh, decided that it was better to uh, settle with me, and, um, and, and I was eventually able to uh, uh, take the, uh, the settlement money and, and eventually was able to get my advanced degree and end up worked for the Smithsonian and worked for Amnesty International and had a number of amazing experiences in Washington, D.C. Well, see, you, that, went, you, you did the right thing. Amazing. God bless you. Uh, I, I figured it was going to end up good. It usually ends up good when you do the right thing. It's usually rough for a while and then just doors open up. So many times I've refused to uh, bow. I've refused to be intimidated. I've refused and I've stepped across the line and just every time the doors just open. Every time. It just gets better. The worse they persecute us, the more God opens the doors for us. But there may be a final physical price and God knows I'm ready. So if God be with us, who can be against us? It's all in God's plan. Let's talk to uh, Jonathan in Florida. Thanks for holding her on the air. Alex, thank you so much for spreading the good word. God bless you. God bless you, my friend. Okay, we have three full nuclear meltdowns right now in Fukushima. Reactor 3 contains eight, contained 89 That's tons. That's a conspiracy. It's good for you. <laughs> oh, of course. Yes, the, the plutonium MOX. It's preposterous burn. that it might be burned. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> Oh, I know. You're, you're right, because it would only take 700 grams dispersing the atmosphere to overdose 7 billion civilians, according to the CCNR, and up to 80 million grams were dispersed. That's enough to overdose every single person on the planet over 100,000 times. But what's wrong with dying? It gives the earth over to the elite. And, well, the elite can't run from this. No one can run from this. The plutonium has the highest... But their father the likes death. I mean... Well, well then they're going to get what they've been asking the for. The bub is nice. God bless you. Good points. Hey, by the way, I didn't cover this today. It's huge. It's up on Infowars.com. It's a blur by Washington's blog. We should all write about this. This should be on the Nightly News tonight. I'm going to do a couple special reports for the Nightly News. I think I'm going to do one on this tonight. Spy agency engaged in internet false flag attacks. NBC News reports what I've already told you. Almost all the cyber attacks and stuff you see and credit cards being released is the government doing it to then claim they need more funding and power. And it's now in a new Snowden document, one reason they're so mad, a new report from NBC News confirms, quote, that the federal government through cybersecurity launched their own false flag operations and then blamed it on their enemies as part of an excuse to take over. Boom, NBC News. We're right again. We're right again. We, I mean, look, if you can think they're doing it, they're doing it. That's how evil works, okay? God gave you a noggin and all that gray matter slopping around up there so you could actually know what's going on on the planet. And this is the type of stuff they do. War on Anonymous, British spies attacked hackers, Snowden Doc show. And that's just NBC getting into that one angle. The big angle is, is that they launched attacks and then blamed it on other hackers. They launched Stuxnet, for heaven's sakes, and then used it to say we need cybersecurity when they launched it. Go to Stuxnet, we need to totally have backdoors and everything so we can really hack and screw things up. I mean, help, help everyone. <laughs> It's so illegal what Greenwald's doing, telling us about the data we stole. Why, he's got stolen data. We stole. Illegally. Outrageous. Arrest that man. Nightly News tonight, 7 o'clock Central. PrisonPlanet.tv. If you're not there, folks, you're not part of the resistance. Spread the word. We need your help.
time and time again. You need to come here and help us. We need assistance. Please. Those we should be able to depend on let us down. Federal and state and local officials saying help is on the way. Well, the folks here in Bell Harbor say show me. Don't depend.